Hush, little baby, don't say a word. Mama's gonna buy you a mockingbird. Welcome to Babyland, home of the Cabbage Patch Kids. Well, here we are, getting ready to go into Babyland Ranch. Look at this. Look how magnificent and large this looks. Let's go in and find out what we can find and adopt maybe today. Mama! We did it this time. We're going to try to adopt a baby today. Well, here we are in Babyland Hospital. The Cabbage Patch Kids. You can even have a fun pick and be a Cabbage Patch Kid. So far, I'm quite impressed. Hey, this one reminds me of somebody. here. Oh. All kinds of cabbage patch kids everywhere. Here's Miss Gardner right there. She's she's taking care of the kids right now. All the Cabbage Patch Kids needs you have, would ever need, are in here. They come right from the cabbage. Ooh. Even the cow is overlooking these Cabbage Patch Kids. The crystals are glowing. That's where the magic from the cabbage happens. I think a Cabbage Patch Kid just winked at me. He's happy to see us. Gypsy Lynn's having the time of her life right now. These Cabbage Patch Kids, waiting for adoption, are playing at the treehouse. Cabbage Patch Kids are coming to life. <laughs> this one's getting on a Baby Land Elementary School. They're ready to learn already. And there's Gwenny up there. Gwenny. There's the baby land tree. This is mother tree and this is where they birthed the babies. Here's where all the babies come from. There's crystals here. This reminds me of something out of Motel Hell, though. I don't know if you ever seen that movie or not. They're alive. They're moving. He is moving.
What is it? Medicine. Yeah, they're glittering. A birth is getting ready to happen as we speak. Right now, Mother Tree is going all the way. Any moment, the branches may start moving. I don't know nothing birth and no babies. <laughs> Definitely no Cabbage Patch babies. Hello everybody and welcome to Babyland. Is this anybody's first visit with us? Quite a few. Well, there's no need to worry because I'm Nurse Katie and I'm an LPN here at Babyland. That stands for Licensed Patch Nurse. And I'm here to assist Mother Cabbage in her delivery today. So the way that we know that she has gone into labor is the crystals around the bottom of the tree begin to glow just a little bit brighter and the bunny bees fly above our heads begin to sprinkle down their magic crystal pollen to help determine if we're having a little boy or a little girl. Now every baby born here at Babyland is special, but this baby is extra special because this baby already has a home to go home to. Do we have a Miss Kennedy in the audience today? Hey Miss Kennedy. Do you want a little boy or a little girl? Girl, all right, so we're gonna help her get her wish. We're all gonna cross our fingers really, really tight and shout peek, 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 loud enough for the bunny bees to hear us. Ready, pink, one, pink, two, three. Pink, yeah. pink, 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 pink. All right, I'm just gonna take a quick sonogram to see what we will be having. Looks like we're having a happy, healthy baby. And with all that pink, we will be having a little girl today. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do for Mother Cabbage is give her a dose of Imagicillin. Okay. Now this does not hurt or harm her, it just helps to loosen her leaves for before and after this delivery. And the next thing I'm gonna do is give her an extra large dose of TLC. Can anybody tell me what TLC stands for? That's right, TLC stands for Tender Love and Care. And here at Baby Now we believe in extra large doses of TLC. And now I'm just gonna make sure that Mother Cabbage is a full 10 leaves apart. And it looks like she is, we're off to a great start. Now she is feeling a little nervous about this delivery, so we need to help her with some quick breathing exercises. Can everybody take a deep breath in? And out. One more time in. And out. And one more time for Miss Kennedy. Deep breath in. And out. Good. So that looks like it helped a lot because I am seeing some movement, which means it is time to push. So I'm going to need your help one more time on the count of three. I need you all to shout push as loud as you can. Ready? One, two, three. Push. One more time, just a little bit louder. One, two, three. Push. And here she is. Oh, yay. I'm just going to wrap her up and tell you guys a little bit about her. So the first thing I noticed is that she was born with a head full of hair. That's okay. That just means our interns did remember to fertilize her part of the patch last night. I also noticed she has beautiful blue eyes. And she also has a cute little outy belly button where I gently clipped her for Mother Cabbage. Now this next part can be very embarrassing for her, so I need you all to promise not to laugh. Can you say I promise? Just like all babies born here at Babyland, she was born with the Xavier Roberts birthmark on her little bottom. And I'm just gonna wrap her back up because she is blushing. So before I take your baby right over there to the Babyland Delivery Nursery, where you can watch her get her very first checkup, she needs a name. Do y'all already have one picked out for her? Be all my lucky. What's your baby? Baby Kay? You wanna name her Kay? Kay Sloan. Kay Sloan, okay, I'll see what she thinks about that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll tell him. She says that she absolutely loves that name with a name like that. She's going to grow up to be a princess just like her mom. Now can everybody give her a hand because today is her birthday. That was just awesome. I probably enjoyed it just as much as the family did. Checking the baby out. Oh, checking. Oh, good reflexes. Look at that.
That is awesome. Right here is the delivery nursery. The storks up there. One more glance at Mother Cabbage. You can sit down and inside the cabbage and be your own Cabbage Patch Kid. The actual picture, not the doll. Gypsy Lynn's reminiscing about her past. These are the ones I remember where parents used to fight over it in the stores back in 1983. That's when I got two of them. How old were you then? Well, uh, I was in high school, but <laughs> my mom got missing. You gotta realize. My sister is eight years younger, so she decided she'd get me two of them. You know what I was doing in 1983? I wasn't playing with them. At that time, I was watching Star Wars Return of the Jedi. <laughs> Very nice place indeed. Stevie Nicks, even Jim Henson, Burt Reynolds. Even Billy Joel. So Xavier's the creator of Cabbage Pack. Charles Schwal. Charles Schultz. All these people love Babyland. Thank you, Babyland. Even one of the greatest Lakers ever. Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Richard Petty. Doc from Back to the Future, Bugs Bunny, The Bushes, even Charles Bronson, even Donald Trump loves the Cabbage Patch Kids. They have stone statues of the Cabbage Patch Kids outside the front lawn. Gypsy Lynn is amazed that such a place exists where you can adopt Cabbage Patch Kids. All in here at Babyland Ranch. Gypsy Lynn noticed something else. Every one of these stone cabbages are different. Great eye. Great eye. And if that horse and cart fall down.